Hi friends, welcome back for another read aloud this week. I have a new caterpillar book for you. We read The Very Hungry Caterpillar earlier this week and I have a different one for you. Um, our one today is called The Very Impatient Caterpillar. And if you are not sure what that word impatient means, it means you cannot wait. So this caterpillar friend definitely is having a hard time waiting. And he is saying, is it time yet? So let's read and find out about the very impatient caterpillar. Hey, what are you guys doing? We're going to metamorphosize. Ooh, that's a big word. Do you have any idea what that might mean? I'll give you a hint. It has to do with changing. Meta what now? Transform into butterflies. Right, right. I knew that. Wait! You're telling me I can become a butterfly? Yes. With wings? Yes. For real? Yes. Wait for me! Now what? Build your chrysalis. Chrysalis. Right, right. I knew that. What? How do you do that? Is it a spin or more of a twist? Am I a butterfly yet? Ugh. Now what? Just be patient and let nature take its course. Patience. Right, right. I got this. Am I a butterfly yet? No. How about now? No. Now? No. Be patient. I have a question. Not yet. You don't even know what I was going to ask. Fine. Ask. How's your day going? Also, am I a butterfly yet? No. Just be patient. This butterfly is having a hard time waiting. Shh! We're trying to metamorphosize. Okay, okay. Obviously, I know this, but do you know how long this takes? Two weeks. Right, right. Two weeks. Two weeks?! Oh, what am I going to do in here for two weeks? Can I get a comic book or something? What if I need the bathroom? Anyone want to play a game? What if I want a snack? Hello, two pizzas, please. My address, a chrysalis. Click. Hello? Hello? How long have I been in here? It's still day one? This is taking forever. That's it. I feel metamorphosized enough. Ooh, I don't know if he's quite there yet. Look out, world. Feast your eyes on this beautiful butterfly. How do I look? Transformed. Time to spread my wings and fly. I think that's going to be hard for our friend. He did not turn into a butterfly yet. Wait! Flap, 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 flap. Where are my wings? Splat. Time for a new approach. Okay, you can do this. You can be patient. Oh, who am I kidding? I can't be patient. Get a grip. You can. I can't. I can't. You are the little caterpillar who could. I am the little caterpillar that couldn't. You can. I can't. Poor caterpillar. You can. I can't. You can. I can't. Can. Can't. I 
I can be patient. Patience is all in the mind. Be one with the chrysalis. Deep breath in and out. Look, day six. I'm doing it. Just be patient. Just be patient. Two weeks later. I did it. I'm a butterfly. You know, I do feel transformed. Starting now, I'm going to be way more patient. That's great. Hey, where are you guys going? We're migrating. Migrating, right, right. Wait for me. Are we there yet? Ugh. I hope you guys like that story. I thought that was pretty funny. That was the first time I read that. But I thought that was pretty funny. Our little caterpillar friend was very impatient, had a very hard time waiting to turn into a butterfly. And I know that sometimes waiting can be hard for us. We've had to been doing a lot of waiting lately where we can't really go out and see our friends and family and we're waiting until they say that it's okay for us to do that. So in the meantime, we have to be patient and find ways to keep ourselves busy. So I hope that you are finding lots of ways to keep patient and keep your mind busy as well. Now that we have read this story too, I have a challenge for you. I would like to challenge you to think about our two caterpillar books we read. We read The Very Hungry Caterpillar and we just read The Very Impatient Caterpillar. And think about how are the stories the same, but how are they different? You could think about the characters in the story, the things that happen, and then tell a family member what is one way that maybe those are the same or are they different? So that's your challenge now that we have read that one. And I will see you guys later for some more read alouds and maybe some more pod sing songs as well. I hope you guys are doing well and staying safe and healthy with your families. And I will see you next time. Bye.